Mexico City, one of the world's most populated urban areas with nearly 22 million residents, may be mere months away from running out of water. Several factors are affecting the water supply, including poor infrastructure and years of abnormally low rainfall. The city's rain season begins in May, and scientists say water reservoirs may not recover until the summer months. CBS News contributor Enrique Acevedo joins us now. Hi, Enrique. So tell us, what has life been like for some of the people feeling the burden of this water shortage? Lana, they have to use the water pipe trucks to fill up their homes uh, with um, any sort of bucket or, um, or you know, any cylindric um, artifact that they have at home so they can store that water. A lot of them have gone days, if not weeks, without running water in their houses. Um, gyms here in Mexico City and other public parks had to start limiting the the number of guests they had uh, you know taking showers and using their facilities because a lot of people were taking advantage of their memberships to use water at, at, at those um, uh, facilities so I, I think it's been uh, you know there's been water scarcity uh, water management uh, in in the city in a way that we hadn't seen in in at least a decade mm. and Enrique obviously droughts happen throughout the world but how did Mexico City's situation get this bad well like you said uh, we've had years of drought that that's one thing the other thing is poor water management um we've had a lot of underwater leaks i think around uh, up to some some figures say up to 40% of the water that's been um, um wasted in the city comes from underwater uh, underground leaks um, mm -hmm. there's also residential leaks so uh, and, and then a lot of the dams around the city have have not filled up in years so you add those factors all up and, and you, you have these this conditions that um, it's not like we have a day zero coming up, but certainly we haven't seen things be as bad as, as they are right now in, in, a lot, in a while. All right, Enrique, thank you. Thank you, Lana.